Don't give me this rhetoric. I'm asking you a specific question. Don't spit it down. Rahul, this is my question. Answer my question. It's not your turn to ask questions. It's your turn to answer them. If tomorrow there's a terrorist attack, can Kejriwal be expected to deliver any governance? If this is the way he's going to act, how can people expect that he'll act with maturity if there is trouble that confronts Delhi? And what is the priority? Let's understand. The problem is, is I'm answering, but you interrupt, Rahul. Yes, sir, not my a priority. My answer was... No, because Dead. you don't answer my Dead. question. Dead. You can't Dead. choose to answer the question you want to answer. You must answer the question I ask you. I'm sorry, Rahul, I will answer the way I like to answer. You might not like it, but you can't... It's not about the way you answer, answer. it's about the answer. question I ask. At least answer at least the question I ask. This is anarchy. What I am provided you the hemi out. I am patient with it. I think I am so God. So what I am saying is, I am answering. It is a logic I have nothing to say. I am answering, Rahul. Answer my question. You are talking about a 26, 11, 11 kind of an yes. attack. You know, I am asking you a question that every day murders, rapes, crime against women are happening in Delhi. Do you want the, the Honorable Chief Minister of Delhi to be accountable for that or not? I am not for a moment talking about 2611. I am talking about day-to-day -day crimes for which the Chief Minister is held accountable by the media and by the people and the electorate. Why should he be held accountable when he is powerless, when he cannot even address so the you question are saying of... So there's a message being sent out. Whether, okay, okay let me put that question to Kiran Walia. Okay, let me ask that question to Kiran Walia. The point that the Aam Aadmi Party is making is that next time a Danish tourist gets raped, next time there's some trouble and people ask Kejriwal, why is it that you are incapable of doing anything? At least Kejriwal can now say that I was out on the streets protesting, I am as helpless as you are, the central government doesn't listen, the Congress doesn't listen, so it's the UPA which is to blame, not the Aam Aadmi Party. In that sense, he's at least over the last 48 hours, Kiran Walia sent that message out. Maud, what the method that he is using is something so ridiculous, it defeats the very end for which he is fighting. <laughs> All of us have been wanting that the state police should come under the Delhi garbage. It is absolutely logical. So, so why didn't Sheila Dixit do anything about it? You had 15 years. Yes. Why did Sheila Dixit not do anything about it? Mrs. Dixit, and the same government in the center. manifesto for 15 years with our own government. We have been demanding and we knew that we cannot What's deliver. What's the point of having it in your manifesto if nothing happens? If nothing comes of, of it, yes. what's the point of when saying on center stage that we had it in a manifesto exactly. for 15 I'm years? Very frank. Sheila Dixit ah. was ruling Delhi. Yeah. You but had I'm Manmohan Singh in the center. Kiran Walia, you had, op you had the opportunity. Why did it take a Kejriwal to come here and protest? Why yes, didn't Kiran Walia and Sheila Dixit do this? Yeah, let me... Let, no, no, I... I just a minute. 1993 to 98, when BJP was in power in the state and they had a government in the center, even they could not succeed. I think those who come into power That's in the center... That's not the answer to the question. Don't blame the BJP. Powers over Why didn't Delhi. you do it? Yes. You had, you had 15 years in governance no, in Delhi. The, you this, had an opportunity, the, Kiran Walia. Why didn't Sheila Dixit ever decide to protest that, at Rail Bhavan, Jantar Mantar, say, Manmohan Singh, I'll sit here till the time I get control of the Delhi police. Why didn't Sheila Dixit do this? Un unlike Mr. Kejriwal, Mrs. Dixit took an all-party delegation to meet the Home Minister, Mr. Adwani, at that time. Oh, come it is on! on record. But we did not go the way, we did not hold the city to ransom. But this is not the way. That is the issue. That what is they brought the city down Why to? Why not? By being lawless, by causing more oh, problems God. for the police or for the state. So this is not the way that it has to be done. That's the crucial issue today. Because okay. this no, no, but the point is, like you had 15 years, in that sense, Ambassador Casey saying... No, no.